and today I'm going to do an in-depth review as much as possible on my beard. Excuse my hair, it's all messed up. Now, uh, usually when I do my updates, my monthly updates, I just show you what's going on. I haven't really got into the beard. It's like the old updates I used to do like two years ago, a year and a half ago, and I'll show everything. So let's get to it. Weak points, strong points. All right, mustache. For now, it's probably looking as good as, ever, as it's ever been. It's because I've been letting it grow, you know, once a shave and let it kind of grow for like a couple weeks, it's patchy, I guess. I've never really seen much of, much of a put, patchy mustache. And it sucks, because I am I come from Mexican genetics, and one of the stereotypes of Mexicans is having a good mustache, right? And not the case with me. Let's try to get in here. If my face is all flaky, it's because I'm on liquid. Um, You can see it's not really, I mean, it's okay at best. It's not really too full. Still patchy looking, but you know, after about two years, well, what, what am I gonna do, right? Let's go to the right side. I'm using my comb here to try to show you, try to dig in there. What's going on in here? You can still see it's, you know, not very, it's not as f like a full, full strong beard. It's still, you could tell it's, if I trim it, it'd be patchy. You know, like right here, it's darker. Some parts are lighter. I don't know if that's because of uh, they're not the lighter parts aren't terminal, or if they're uh, because I don't have as much hair follicles. Excuse me. Let's try the left side. Same story. Right here, darker, lighter hairs. You know. I don't know if it's ever gonna change, but let's hope it does, right? And under lip. Whoops, did not mean to zoom in. Sorry, I got a new phone, guys, so I'm trying to figure this stuff out. On my old phone, I just have to double tap and zoom in on this phone. I don't know what the heck's going on. You know, looking thick right here. Um, right here, this the bald spots don't really fill in. I've been, I mean, I've had hair there for like since I started, but they just don't want to transition at all. Neck area, this right here, this whole chin and jaw area is really coarse. It's really difficult to apply minoxidil there. But I wanted to show you guys. Here's the neckline. Try to line it up. Never comes out good. That's all me. I know this video is all over the place. Just wanted to show you guys a quick in-depth review of my beard. Three weeks, in exactly three weeks. It'll be two years, but I'm probably gonna make more videos between now and then. Um, thank you guys so much for the support, and I'll see you guys next time.